Sarah. Welcome to The Daily English Show. On Wednesdays we study a mistake and today we're looking at a mistake in a tattoo. This tattoo says no regrets. Can you spot the mistake? That's right. The A should be an E. Regrets is spelt R-E-G-R-E-T-S. This actually comes from a movie that came out in 2013 called Where the Millers. I've never seen it, but I've seen a lot of people on the internet write no regrets with an A, obviously spelling it wrong on purpose. And I finally looked it up and it turns out it comes from this movie. I saw a clip of the scene where they're talking about the tattoo. It's pretty funny. You should go and check it out. Recently I came across a Twitter account with some amusing tweets that I thought I'd share with you. The account is called Very British Problems and the Twitter handle is at So Very British. The tweets describe situations that you might experience in life and I don't think you have to be British to relate to them. They're more human problems than British problems with a particular focus on being a bit socially awkward and shy and polite. Some of them are translations explaining what people really mean sometimes when they're being polite. Here's one of the tweets. Anyway, I'll let you get on. Translation. Please go away. I'll let you get on is a polite way of ending a conversation. Another way you could say that is, I'd better let you go. For example, if you're on the phone talking to someone and you want to wrap up the conversation because you have something that you need to do or just because you've had enough of the conversation, then to be polite you might say, well I'd better let you go when what you really mean is, I want to finish this conversation. Here's another tweet. How's the rest of your afternoon looking? Translation, I'm about to give you loads of work. This is something that you're quite likely to hear at an office and if you hear that question, how's the rest of your afternoon looking or how's your morning looking, then I'd say there's a 99% chance that they're about to give you more work. Here's a couple more of their tweets. Honestly, don't worry about it. Translation, what the hell have you done? And let's come back to that. Translation, let's forget about that immediately and forever. Can you relate to these tweets? How about if you translate them to another language? Kia ora, in Stick News today, Lindsay Lohan accidentally told millions of people on Twitter, you're a donkey, in Arabic. Lindsay Lohan is an American actor who starred in the 2004 film Mean Girls. She now has almost 9 million followers on Twitter. On Monday, Lindsay tweeted a picture from her Instagram feed which said, You're beautiful in English and you're a donkey in Arabic. And that was Stick News for Wednesday the 22nd of April. Kia ora. Today's word is livid. Livid means extremely angry. Here's a tweet from at So Very British. Removing the kind from kind regards to let the recipient know you're absolutely bloody livid. Kind regards is one way you can end an email. There are many different ways to sign off at the end of an email, including many variations of regards, such as best regards, kind regards, warm regards, warmest regards, and just regards. I can definitely relate to this tweet and I may have done something similar myself, going to write something friendly like warm regards and then stopping and thinking, actually no warm regards for you so you just get regards, send. How about you? Can you relate to this tweet? How was your weekend? Giant poppy? Oh, is that for Anzac Day? Where is that? Pretty good. 
I went to see the giant poppy on Sunday. Yeah, it's an art installation. They're making a giant poppy out of thousands of metal discs. You can write a message on a disc and add it to the giant poppy. Yeah, Anzac Day's on sad days, so the poppy thing's going on all week, I think. In the Domain by the Museum. The No Regrets tattoo was in the movie A. Mean Girls B. We're the Millers We're the Millers I'll let you get on means A. Please go away B. Please keep talking Please go away If someone says How's the rest of your afternoon looking? They're probably about to give you A loads of work B the afternoon off loads of work if someone says honestly don't worry about it they might really mean A I admire your honesty B what the hell have you done what the hell have you done if someone says let's come back to that they probably want to a. Deal with the issue immediately. B. Forget about it immediately and forever. Forget about it immediately and forever. And that was The Daily English Show. I hope you enjoyed the show. Please go and check out at So Very British. You can also follow us on Twitter at Studio TDES. We tweet when there's a new show up. And I also tweet occasionally. I'm at TDES. See you tomorrow. Bye.